Okay, and here we are for the game between the Delco Demons Orange team wearing the white jerseys and Long Island 495ers red. Our second look at the 495ers red. They played earlier. Lost in overtime, two to one. And what was a terrific game with the South Jersey Cougars. Long Island Red was wearing the blue jerseys. That's Scardino sending it in deep for Long Island. Now control, snapshot and a save. And we're gonna try to get a look on who's playing net down there. Can you guys see if that's 34 or 31 down there in the Delco net? That's a 34 down there. That Dave. would be Sean Yingling, number 34, and number 32, Todd Scarola back in net for the 495ers. This is minor league action. American Inline Hockey League live coverage coming from Feasterville, Pennsylvania on March 2nd, 2013. Dave Goddard on the play-by-play. -play. Ryan Hayes joined me on color. Jimmy Celeste on the board and John Quigg on a camera. And Hayes, what have you seen so far? We've only played a minute 15. Minute 15 in, and uh, looks like 495ers are controlling most of the play here. I'm waiting to see what Delta can do. Teams are skating at full strength, four on four. That's Alec Tarzinski with the puck. Sends it behind the net and picking up is Rob Basquill. Everybody touching the puck now. Sable has it and sends it up to Zwolak. Zwolak long pass and fanning on it. One time chance by Tarzinski. You see that in the minors, guys going right to the net. The home run pass, looking for the one-timer. Moving in, a snapshot and a save by Scarola, and he hangs on. Terrific chance by Pete Zolak. Moving in for the Demons, Hayes. Yeah, it was a nice play by Skarzynski there to step up and take away any angle that the shooter might have had. It's good to have a goalie coming, call, call a commentator here. That's you, you have Ruppy Haley, who's another goalie commentator, and he gets the goalie perspective of things. We have to bring one goalie with us on the trip. It's mandatory. It is, it is. And we only brought one. Only, only one real one. <laughs> I'm still that much better than Hayes. Demons moving in, shot and a save by Scardola. As this time, Nolan was moving in on the play. A lot of action down here. Yeah, Scardola seems to be playing a very aggressive style of goaltending right now. He's really coming about four or five feet out of the crease, cutting down those angles. Puck to Nelson now. Nelson had a strong game earlier against the Cougars in the two to one loss. And the Vaji holding the puck now as they slow it down. Coming up on a two and a half minute mark played here in the opening half. And after a couple of mixed flurries down here at the Long Island end, it settled down. Moving in the slot, hit the post and stays out. He rang the post, that might have been Berger down there now. Coming the other way, the Demons, and a shot just Ooh. went wide. Terrific chance, Dominic Gricko went to the forehand, had Scardola down, and just couldn't tuck it in there, Hayes. Yeah, bo both goalies just uh, you know, just missed getting scored on right here. Yangling seemed uh, a little flat on his feet there, wasn't expecting the chance. And then the other way, Scardola went down kind of early and almost got beat. And right up the gut coming Nolan, as the game opens up now. Snapshot and a save by Yingling as that was Berger ripping one off. All the play down in the Delco Orange Zone. In this minor league matchup has been a good one so far. We've only played three and a half minutes. Pogating Divas Panaccio. Now up on the wing trying to connect with his man and does. Moving in was Hutchison. Actually, no, that was rather Cloughton. Matt Cloughton, number six. He had it hopped off his stick. Coming back, two on two and a shot to score! Nikki Lang roofing it on Yingling. And it's one to nothing. Hazer? Yeah, Lang looked off his, uh, his fellow winger there. Gave him a quick look like he was gonna pass and got the goalie to drop down a little early and sniped it over his shoulder. one nothing on score in favor of Long Island. Nikki Lang, 24. We'll check, we might have a replay on that goal. We'll check it out in a bit. Lang controlling, sending it back to Scardino as Long Island moves it around. 
Snap shot, save by Yingling. Rebound shot and another save, and it goes behind the net now. Yingling now the busier the two goalies, Hayes. Yeah, yeah, he's had to make a couple of uh, quick stops right here to keep it at a one-goal game. Zolak sends it behind his net as Delco tries to break it out. They've been hemmed in for the last few seconds. Pushing it in deep is Panaccio. Panaccio loses it to Lang. And the puck comes up and it's two on two the other way. On his horse is Scott Pinella. Oh, snap shot, pad save and covers up is Yingling. And after a couple of quick early shots by the Demons, been all 495ers. Yeah, we saw this from them in the in the early game actually. They, uh, they're a possession kind of team. They don't seem to mind if they only get a couple of shots per half, per period. They, uh, they, they choose quality over quantity, that's for sure. And they like to control the play. Back to live action, Long Island controlling the puck, coming up on seven minutes to play in the first half. Scardino goes behind the net, sends it in front. Try to slippery pass to Corso. Didn't get there, but Long Island still controls. I don't think anybody's expecting that pass. No, it sort of didn't look like it. A snapshot and a save by Yingling as Corso threw it at the net. Yingling played that right. Came out and challenged, didn't give the shooter much to look at. One nothing on score, Long Island in the blue. Tielko Demons in the white. Two teams trying to get a couple of big points, Hayes, to get into the playoffs. Yeah, the 495ers came, uh, came very close to getting two points in the last game. Just a, a heartbreaker in overtime. Yeah, they picked up a point yep. so that they Hang on here. And pick up uh oh. Up. The demon's moving it in. Nice play by Scadola. There you go. Scadola stopping Clouton again. Trying to go around him. He dropped the shot and a save the other way. Rebound in front and the shot hit the side of the net. Couple of terrific shots by Scardino at the other end for Long Island. And both goalies staying busy. Scarola, the goalie here for Long Island. Now he's going to have to come out and play the rolling puck, but. That's twice players have tried to go around him, and it just hasn't quite worked out. Yeah, like I said, he's playing a very aggressive style, so they're going to have to start coming in and taking their shots a little earlier because the closer you get to him, the more the net he's taking away. Shot tipped, and that's saved by Yingling. Pushed up on the sideboards. Gricko with it. Gricko all the way to the other side, and here come the Demons. Going to the backhand. It didn't quite work. Sable, Mike Sable trying to get it. And it's poked out the center by Long Island. Now they curl back in their own zone. Berger with it. Berger up over center. Actually, that's Scarpanella out of 94. Scarpanella with it. Sends it back to Janky. Janky shot hit the side of the net. Took a funny hop. Gricko settles it down. Fans on his pass. Gricko lost it. And it squirts all the way back to center. 445 the play, one nothing to score. Again, the 495ers are carrying the play and taking it to Delco right now. Delco has got to get it out of their zone and establish some pressure in the Long Island end. Absolutely. Janky on the sideboards. Over to Nelson, back to Janky. It looks like a power play out there right now, Hazer. Yeah, it really does. They are just in control of this game right now. Holding the puck, throwing at the net, shot and a save by Yingling. They still can't get it out. Spinorama shot by Berger was blocked. Berger controls the puck, takes a bunt. Berger sends it back into his own zone, and still, it's all about control right now. Yeah, Long Island is just maintaining possession. I mean, 13 minutes, uh, 11 minutes played so far in this half, and it feels like 10 of it's been played in the Delco end. Shot high, that's a save by Yingling and a pie. Goes in the corner, Berger battling with his man. Coming in to help out was Lang. Not sure Yingling saw that until the last minute. That was a nice reaction save by yeah. him to get that over the net. Delco moving the, into the zone. Pass, actually shot, went wide by Panaccio. On the sideboards, Nolan has it. Nolan trying to throw it in front. Nice defensive play here by Long Island. Tim Janke moving in to help. Oh, a high stick to the face on Lang. Didn't see it. Refs didn't see it. The refs missed one there. Yeah, they did. 
shot just goes wide by Nolan on the sideboard as it's Gricko, but he lost it. Gricko trying to lift the stick of Nelson, and Nelson skates it away. Nelson up over the red. Nelson up over the blue. Slides it past the Lang. Shot to save by Yingling. Yingling bailing out the defense right there. Big play. Nolan trying to get it out. Couldn't do it. Kept in by Berger. Berger, he slides it over to Janky. Janky's shot was blocked. Players are bumping in deep. Nearly took a hop out in front. Berger was sitting there drooling for that puck. Didn't come to him, though. And here comes Nolan the other way. Nolan's actually going to send a backhand pass into his own zone to Gricko, and Nolan's going to change up. 2.40 to play in the first half. Long pass. Now had to hop over the stick. Going to the front of the net was Zolak. Zolak now gets it. Zolak has a man going to the front. Chipped away. Escadola shot to save by Escadola on Gricko. And finally, some chances for Delco here, Hayes. Yep, yeah, it's nice to see them get a couple of shots on net, but once again, Scrollo is uh, playing, playing very well in the net. 